A young mother is dead, and right now family and students are coming together at Lancaster High School to remember Ikea Hood. Steve Pickett live for us outside the school. Steve, what can you tell us? Well, the heartbreak uh, here that has impacted this community, folks willing to support this young woman who was killed, only 17 years of age. You can see all of those who have responded here to this location, bringing posters, bringing balloons, all in support of this victim. And by the way, her baby girl, this 17-year-old, was a mother who was killed in all of this. This appears to be a case of deadly domestic violence, and everyone here is here to show support for that victim. Uh, her her former boyfriend, we're, called, we're told, now accused of killing her. Now, this is the victim. Her name is Ikea Wood. She's 17 years of age. She died on Monday after being shot while inside her far southwest Dallas house. This happened on Monday. Lancaster School District officials telling us Miss uh, Ikea Hood, she was a very popular student here. We can see it manifested by so many here today uh, involved in the school's dance and drill team. She was also a young mother giving birth birth to a baby girl very recently. Now, an arrest warrant for murder. It identifies this young man, 19 years of age. His name is Trevon Wright, now the accused killer. He is a former boyfriend. The affidavit that we saw today indicates Ikea had planned on telling uh, Trayvon Wright that he was not the father of her newborn baby girl. Now, the victim's mother told detectives, based on what we saw in that affidavit, that um, Mr. Wright was in their home when she heard gunfire. He is now in custody, being held on a $500,000 bond for that murder case. More importantly at this point is that this community wanted to show support for this young lady, this student and her baby here today. Right here in the next few minutes, they will have this balloon release. They have brought gifts for this child, for this infant. Most of them are uh, graduates and students of Lancaster High School. We'll bring you an update, of course, at 7. For now, reporting live, Steve Pickett, CBS News, Texas. This is an awful story. Steve, thank you so much. We'll